Welcome to the know. I'm Meg Turney. Can we go just one day without a Witcher 3 story? The answer is no. No, we cannot. This time, the highly acclaimed title has an appetite for game saves on Xbox One, and people are... Well, people are pissed. People are always pissed, but hey, if you lost progress in a game as expansive as The Witcher 3, you'd probably be pissed too. I know I would be. Players on Xbox One have been reporting that they're unable to save their progress, which is, you know, never a good thing. And the common thread among them seems to be that they all left the game to idle for some time before returning to it, and once they return, their ability to save had vanished. That's what you get for leaving it. One such unfortunate soul was Game Informer's executive editor, Andrew Reiner, and it drove him to write an opinion piece about the bug called I'm Done Playing Witcher 3 Until CD Projekt Red Fixes It. In it, he describes his experience with losing progress not once, not twice, but thrice my friends, and writes, Losing progress in the game like The Witcher 3, which heavily favors choice and emergent storytelling, can be crushing. Getting a second chance to correct a wrong or see a story play out in a different way is something no player should experience unless they are playing the game for a second time. I now feel like I'm Bill Murray in Groundhog Day, sick of hearing the same conversations, bored of the same events, and praying that my game saves and I can see new content again. I love it, it's so dramatic. He also mentions that his tweets about the matter caught the attention of the game's developer, CD Projekt Red, and that they gave him a few temporary fixes, though he calls them a band-aid on a gaping wound, and I'm inclined to agree. I've linked his article in the description down below so you can find the dev's fixes there. In short, they involve clearing the console's cache by unplugging it, yes the old on-off trick, and manually clearing the console's cache save games, but I have to say this so I sleep well at night. If you don't have cloud saves on, that will fuck you real hard. So don't do it unless you got cloud saves on. And also it still might screw you over a little bit. There's a big warning on it. Check out the article. Okay. So, how do you know if this elusive and devastating bug already has its fangs in you? Well, it seems to pop up in a few different ways, like I said, but aside from having left the game to idle, many gamers also report that when they entered the save menu, they were met with the text, cannot save at this time. If you see that, it's already too late for you. We salute you and hope that you haven't played too long without checking that out. CD Projekt Red is, as I said before, aware of the issue, and although they don't have a fixed date just yet, they have said it's a priority, which it damn well should be. So, what's the worst way you've ever lost progress in a game? I have a buggy SNES that I refuse to replace for some reason, and it randomly resets my games and clears everything on the cartridge when it does. It hurts every time. Please tell us your stories of woe in the comments down below. Don't forget, you get the very best in video games and entertainment right here, so make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel so you can know what we know and be in the know on this show. Heart you!